In Louisiana, a man seen on video running naked through a Winn-Dixie parking lot before getting into an SUV and crashing into it, <laughs> uh, crashing it into a truck will face <laughs> charges as soon as he is released from the hospital where he's undergoing a psychiatric evaluation. The sheriff's office says this happened on September 25th. What was that, two days ago? Cell phone video shows the fully nude man running up to an empty and unlocked SUV. The man bangs on the driver's side window before opening the door and climbing inside. Gross. Shortly after, the SUV takes off in the parking lot, driving in a circle. The SUV then crashes into the passenger side of another truck in the parking lot with enough force to roll the truck over. With millions watching and many people benefiting from this, program called Indisputable. We just need 1% of the viewers to become a paid member so we can continue to bring this content to you. Now back to the show. The sheriff's office says the truck driver sustained an injury to his hand while climbing out through a broken rear window. Immediately after the crash, the video shows the nude man leaving the SUV and skipping away from the scene. Here's what local news had to say. St. Charles Parish deputies detained the man who was identified as a 24-year-old from Destrahan. Uh, because of his behavior, deputies say he was admitted to the hospital for psychiatric evaluation. Investigators also took samples to test for drugs and alcohol. According to the sheriff's office, once the, the man is released from the hospital, he will be arrested on an outstanding arrest warrant for charges related to DWI, aggravated battery and aggravated criminal damage to property. I guess we'll we'll hear later about the results of that psychiatric evaluation, maybe if it gets reported. But yeah, like that's not a normal thing to do. You don't run around naked in a Winn Dixie parking lot. I don't care what kind of parking lot it is. You don't do it. Jackson, what do you think? I don't know what <laughs> My man, is. he was on a mission. He had to do that. Whatever it is that he was doing, he had to get it done. Now this is drugs for sure, like for sure and for certain. This is the this is like meth, maybe meth for something, you know. Um, but d definitely good that uh, nobody's hurt. But I think this is a story that we can uh, more safely laugh at openly. Um, <laughs> but, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? My man, he had to take off all his clothes. That's how you know it's real. I I've been. Where there's places in, uh, in, in somewhere in the city in St. Louis or when I'm in New York or, or you know, wherever, any any play, any time you're in a, a city area, you yeah. might see something like this. I've seen people butt naked out in the street. And obviously, yeah. when they are, they're totally out of their mind somewhere else. Drugs really can be powerful. But uh, my man's he had to get that done. He was on a mission. So uh, give him an A now, for effort. Where, where, where are you in the country? Right? Where, where do you live? I'm in St. Louis right now. Here's your, yeah. Well, here mm -hmm. in the South, I'm going to tell you, it is it is really hot down here. Maybe he was very, very hot. And the hot hey. can make you crazy, you know? It can. He was and just frustrated. Crazy. Especially, like, we're almost in October. It's too hot out here, you know? It's making people crazy. And, you know, maybe that's where he was coming from. Plus, the maybe drugs wasn't helping. So, for whatever reason, that's what he decided to do that day. And we're going to you know, try and follow up on the story for later. So yeah, next uh, time you do whenever you do meth, you got to make sure that it's not a 100 degree heat, you know, room temperatures best, you know, to keep it safe. That's good advice. I didn't know yeah. that because I've yeah. never done meth. But you know, <laughs> maybe that's relevant to someone somewhere. All right. <laughs>